सो करेंटली आई एम इन फ्रंट ऑफ यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ लाइफ सिक एज यू कैन सी फ्लैश बैक हेलो गाइस वेलकम बैक टू अ न्यू वीडियो एंड वेयर आर वी गोइंग टुडे लेट्स फाइंड आउट एट द मोमेंट आई एम एट बर्लिन हॉपन ऑफ एंड वी आर गोइंग समवेयर लेट्स सी so welcome welcome to the city of leipzig today um, we are here in the leipzig and yeah so the plan is we will visit um, main attractions and i will give you information about university of um, leipzig what kind of courses there are and um, where is it and many more information so let's see how it will go just behind me as you can see there is like the hop on off so as you see behind me i am in the center uh, probably uh, it is just in front of um, hopbahnhof and this is my first time in leipzig even though i'm living in germany for like 4 years i will complete 4 years in october but i didn't get the chance to visit the city and today i'm here so currently i'm walking in the city center and there are really big buildings around here they looks really good with some cafes just as you can see behind me there are many cafes restaurants and yeah they looks good not crowdy dekhte hain aage kya kya dekhne ko milta hai well we already reached out to our first um sight seeing location so this is just behind me this uh, big structure This is Saint Nicholas Church here in um, Leipzig. It is really famous in here. According to DW News, it was one of the most visited churches in Germany last year. So, if you are coming to Leipzig, I highly recommend to watch it out. just like in any other city of germany street artists are very active here in leipzig as well but one strange experience happened with me when this guy asked me to first pay and then shoot the video but not everybody is like that like here they are performing very independently
so as you see the building just behind me which looks really royal um feel uh, which gives really royal feel and looks very old as well so this is the um, old rat house here in leipzig and now it turns out to be a museum um it is a complicated name but it is a very old and very big So this is the main street here in Leipzig, which is very crowded, and most of the people out there because today is weekend. Buses are going on, so this is very local street up here. And this city, um, no, this street is known as um, Grimmische Straße, and this is the main street. I would like to um, tell you some facts about Leipzig. So. Like currently, the population is around six hundred thousand people. Um, so yeah, and it is one of the second populous um, city in the formerly known as in East Germany, and most populous in Saxony, I think. Yeah, and overall, it's seventh most um, populous city in Germany. Yes, you heard it right. There are many churches in Leipzig, but the two main churches here in Leipzig um, are Nicholas Church and the Saint Thomas Church. So, which you can see. So behind me is the Saint Thomas Church. It is also very big, and the structure is really old. I don't know much about the history, but it looks really um, marvelous. And let's see how it looks like um, from the inside and nearby as well. When you think about um, a bank and its building, you probably think about a corporate office or um, a very, you know, a very corporatey building. But here in Leipzig, um, just behind me, this um, yellow building, this is actually a bank building, Commerce Bank, as you see this. But the building looks very royal. So yeah, this is also wonder in Germany or in Leipzig. So just behind me, this is the entrance for the Saint Thomas Church. Yeah, not so much people, but yeah, it's on. It's Saturday, probably on Sunday. It is much more crowded than usual. Currently, I'm in front of University of Leipzig. As you can see, the building is very modern. Like it is not like other universities. Like I already show you, University of Regensburg or University of Augsburg. It is a bit different. The structure is very, um, very modern, very classy, and um, very elegant. I would say this is very attractive. I would say as you see these picture on the google as well so university of leipzig um, have something around 30000 students and there are many courses like mathematical physics computer science well computer science is um, provided by leipzig university of applied sciences but here at the university of leipzig as well there are economics um, courses physics courses and there are so many varieties i will show you in some moments um, the inside view as well and let's see how it looks like. Inside of the university is very quiet. People are not talking too much. But you know what? I found very um, 
good place very interesting place as you can see just at the back of me there are sitting places where you can charge your phones or work on your um, system or laptops or on your phone which is really good i mean very friendly not just for the students but um, for the professors or for other people as well like i will going to use it to charge my phone that board is for the new departments like where you will find those departments so in total there are five floors It seems like there is an event going on. Um, it is decorated and some music is playing and they are testing it. But still, the auditorium is really fascinating. It looks really good, really, um, you know, like a concert hall. Well, the university is in the center of the city. Usually, universities in different cities of Germany are in the outskirt areas not in the center but really student friendly and yeah. so there are in total four universities in leipzig but two main universities are university of leipzig and the and the other one is the hochschule for technik um wirtschaft und kultur so this is like an um, applied science university where you will find out technical programs i hope they are providing the accommodation or the student hostels as well in the city center in my experience leipzig is very livable very student friendly i don't think it is very expensive i googled it before coming here so the daily expense for a student i think um, is something around 800 in this inflation time you know so uh, it includes rent as well so if you are looking for a place leipzig in saxony is very student friendly and I highly recommend it. And I think I forget to mention that semester fee at university here is something around 195 euros per semester including the local transport. So currently I'm in the front of Red Bull Arena which is the home ground for the RB Leipzig and the nearest tram station is Sports Forum so if you are a fan of football and um, you probably know that RB Leipzig doing good in the um, in the current season of Bundesliga as well and yeah so they are playing Bundesliga and they sometimes qualify for Champions League as well or I think uh, from the last two or three seasons they are qualifying for Champions League regularly so they are they are a good team so let's see so currently there is a market just in front of uh, you know the area just in front of the stadium and there is some market going it was a flea market unfortunately stadium is closed so there is a um, grilling railing so i cannot cross this area and as you see just behind me this this one the shade this is the um, roof of the stadium probably it is the end of season and stadium is closed players are on holidays so that's why they close the 
stadium. You know, in this flea market, just in front of the stadium, they are selling vegetables, and it feels so like they do in India. You know, like beef rupee kilo aloo and all these things. If you can hear it. I was roaming in the city um, with a tram, and then I found out that there is a Supreme Court, like Federal Supreme Court of Germany, is here. I don't know. There are many Supreme Courts. I mean, one or more Supreme Courts in Germany, or only one. But here it is in Leipzig. Looks very cultural and historic. I would say. So that's it. That's it from the Leipzig. If you are with me till the end, then do like this video. And if your friend is coming or your friends are coming to Leipzig or Germany, do share with them. As you can see, Aoka is there in behind me, which is like a health insurance company. So yeah, back to topic. So if you are coming or your friends are coming to Germany, then do share this video with them. Um, it is a little bit helpful about university of leipzig what kind of courses they are providing and accommodation and etc and so forth so yeah subscribe to my channel to follow more such content and i'm going to cover more such universities in coming weeks so goodbye